Hi and welcome to our series Inside the Box where we take you through all the new and exciting features on Insider's platform. Today we are going to talk about measuring and reporting your cross-channel marketing ROI. One of the biggest challenges of marketing is reporting on its ROI or more specifically return on marketing investment. While most marketers can measure the performance on individual channels like say on-site personalization, email marketing, push notifications and more, it is often hard to combine the effect of these channels and report on them together. With our new ROI dashboard, we are trying to solve exactly this problem. The dashboard gives you a quick view of your cross-channel marketing efforts and the results. To get started, just select a date range and first thing you'll notice are the two most important metrics from our ROI perspective. First is the total incremental revenue and the second is the uplift in conversions generated by your campaigns. You can toggle to easily see daily or monthly trends as well. Once you understand your overall ROI, you can start tracing it back to your individual channels and get a quick glimpse of the most important metrics for each of your channels. For example, you can look at your mobile users, session, activity and revenue. You can monitor your web push metrics for campaigns and opt-ins. You can also monitor your email sends and performances. And finally, you can also see how your additional goals like say add to carts or page views or any goals that matter to your business are actually performing. While this is a great view for decision makers and C-level to get a good understanding of how the cross-channel marketing program is doing, for you as a marketer, you can also drill down into each individual channel's performance further to help you with your decision making. Let's take an example of how you could drill down into looking at all of the on-site personalizations or experiments that you're running. This is similar to the cross-channel ROI dashboard, but specifically shows the revenue and conversion rate for your website personalization efforts. You can further filter based on the type of the experiment. So for example, it could be an on-site banner or a social proof or a recommendation. You could also only look at the experiments that have reached a certain significance level and apply many other filters to reach your desired combination. Another example is where you could zoom into your email marketing performance and look at the overall opens, clicks and conversion rates for all your emails. You can also get subscriber insights like how are unsubscription rates going up or down over time, what are the top devices and email clients for your subscriber base and much more. If you're looking at delivering cross-channel experiences that can also be effectively measured and tracked for ROI, this dashboard could be your go-to destination. Click on the link to request a free demo and learn more about Insider's platform. Thanks for watching.